So, you're my cousin, Margaret. My mother was your mother's cousin, according to Uncle Max. Oh, it's an uncanny resemblance. You're practically sisters. Wh why aren't you home for Christmas? This time of year, I prefer to be in Philadelphia, away from my family and all those kids. You don't have children? Keep your eyes wide open before marriage and half shut afterward. I never got to the half shut part. What's your excuse? Well, for not being married, I don't have an excuse. I just have very good reasons. Like what? I think that marriage is something you need to have a reason to enter into. I never found that reason. Hmm, I totally agree. Experience keeps a dear school, but fools learn in no other. You see, Margaret is a big fan of Benjamin Franklin. Yes, he was the smartest man who ever lived. His advice has never failed me. Actually, the person with the highest recorded IQ is Marilyn Von Savant. Ooh, Tim was so learned that he could name a horse in nine languages, so ignorant that he bought a cow to ride on. I don't think this is going to work. L listen, family reunions are always awkward. Well, do you think this is going well? Not really. You seem like a bit of a know-it-all. Nice to meet you, but I'm going to El Salvador for Christmas. You both are welcome to use my place over the holidays. He that won't be counseled can't be helped. I told you to keep to Ben's scientific stuff. You're not going to El Salvador for Christmas? Mm hmm You don't strike me as someone who's flexible about their schedule. Well, I took advice from someone who knows more about families than I do. He that raises a large family does stand a broader mark for sorrow, but then stands a broader mark for pleasure as well. Well, that's sort of what he said, but without the pleasure part. Booth. Yeah, so the explosives unit checked out Holden Chevalier's garage, there's nothing. And uh, this guy's name doesn't even pop up in the system. Th that's very interesting, but Which I... Which just confirms that we have to find his accomplice. Nice tree. Oh, wow. Who is this, your sister? No, um... My second cousin. Um, Margaret. There's no resemblance. What do you mean? You're both very beautiful. Beauty and folly are old companions. Told you. Benjamin Franklin. Right, right. Hey, hey, good old Ben, you know, he invented electricity and a hundred dollar bill. Neither one of those things is true. You're right, there's no resemblance whatsoever. Nice meeting you, Maggie. <clears throat> Bye, Booth. See you. Uh, that's my partner. He's FBI. His eyes are too small to be really handsome. Well, I have to admit, I find him pleasing to look at. 